So let's get right to it, let's get right to it. So you say you work with Dipset, State Property, and some of the greats. So for people who don't understand what is it like to work with celebrities or work with artists who grind, give me some differences between some of the artists and some of the things that you had to do to be able to deal with both different kind of camps, different kind of people from Philadelphia and New York being an a and Oh man, what I was doing from old camps I was different. I was different. Like probably pretty much. Uh, I'm not even gonna say different. I was just pretty much moving and grooving. You know what I'm saying? I was pretty much supplying them with, you know, with the production. You know what I mean? Being there at all studios. You know what I mean? Whether it's for Freeway. You know what I mean? Or, or Kanye. You know what I'm saying? Or if I have to go to the studio to, you know what I mean? Drop this beat off to to you know. To, to hove or whatever the case is that that Lenny probably gave me to go drop to him, you know what I mean. So it, it's it's pretty much a collective of a lot of things, man. It's it's it, it's it's crazy, you know what I mean. Like with Dipset, I'll I'll just bring beats to them, you know what I'm saying, and give out any kind of help I can, you know what I'm saying. So and, question, right? Yeah. By bringing the beats, you say Lenny S yes, might give it to you, whoever, right? Right. How do you decide which beats you bring to which artist? Because each artist. As we know, it's different from Cameron to Jewels right. to State Property to Kanye. How do you say which beats go to who? Mm, well, me, I got a crazy ear. You know, I, mean? I could automatically hear a beat and I could be like, okay, this one's for, for I can hear. You know what I'm saying? So and tell me one time where you picked the beat for a person and that was that beat and it did what it did. Okay, let's say for example, uh, Young Guns, you know, Can't Stop, Won't Stop, that was, you know, Six Figure Digger, you know what I mean? Shout out what to you Six Figure Can't Digger. Stop, Won't Stop, Rockefeller <laughs> Figures, we get, we get down, baby, you picked that. Yeah, yes yeah, sir, yes yeah, sir. In fact, I, you know what I mean, I, I picked most of those beats, you know what I'm saying, on that album. You know, when I was working on that album, So how did you crazy. get that beat, and tell me the process of getting that beat, and actually getting that beat to the Young Guns? Man, it was uh, Gino, I know, and Six Figure, man, when I, once I heard that beat. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I automatically just, you know, gave him this. It was on the CD. I remember we had, you know, we carried the beats on the CD. Yeah. So we had, to, I just gave it to, you know, to, to both of them. You know what I mean? To Young Guns. You know what I'm saying? And and, you know, and that was it. History was made from there. You know what I'm saying? They they made a crazy, crazy ass hit. You know what I mean? With that. You know what I'm saying? That's how it okay. was. But yeah, shout out to Gino. Shout out to Six Figure. You know what I mean? Like, cause the producers used to come to the office and drop the beats off to us. You know what I mean? Give us the CDs and everything, and we would just go through it and rummage through everything. While we was in the office, you know right. what I mean? So, next question would be, what did it feel like knowing that that beat was picked and it was a hit? And for the viewers who love to watch and who think they know everything, what was the payout like for you being paid as an a How does that work when you discover a hit record beat? For the people who don't understand how the business works. Oh, man. How that works is, is credit, man. Credit is like the most important thing in the world. You know what I mean? Once you have that credit, that's like more it's more than a billion dollars or whatever. You know what I'm saying? So that's that's how <clears throat> excuse me. That's how, you know what I mean, the A R gets paid. You know, when you got points, you got, you know, kinds of other things too as well. You know what I mean? It's all it all depends on the situation of the record. You know what I'm saying? So that's what pretty much went down with that. You know what I mean? But, but more so, you know, my credit is what, you know, is what stopped you know what I mean, stamped me. You know what I mean? It made me you know what I mean? So you worked with early Kanye West. You been there, because we've seen many, many interviews of everybody with they take on what was going down. So they probably spoke on what they felt was was going down during a um during a um split. So what's your take on the split as far as you seeing it happen and it happening? Oh man. It's tragic, man. It's tragic. Hearing that split was tragic, bro. You know what I mean? Seeing it and witnessing it, you know what I mean? And certain details I don't want to get into, but it's like just being there, you know what I mean? And just witnessing it was just like, oh man, you know, I was there for every bits and pieces of, you know what I mean? Seeing it so go So what was wherever. your personal thoughts for right this split? Did you feel like you had to take sides? Did you feel like it could have been something that could have lasted longer? Or did you feel like evolution is natural and things have to change for whatever reason? Oh man, I felt like... I felt like it was evolution, you know, I feel like, you know, it's a growth thing with, most, most likely with Hov, you know what I mean, he wants to, you know, expand. expand, you know what I'm saying, and, you know, at the end of the day, you know, it's like, who would have thought that that would have happened, you know what I mean, a lot of history was made with Rockefeller, so, 
being that a lot of history was made with Rockefeller, you know what I'm saying? It was like, who wanted to see that split up, you know what I mean? Like, that 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 was just definitely tragic, you know what I mean? But I was there for every step of, of the way, you know what I mean? When I, you know, as far as certain things, you know what I mean? And, so when the split did happen, yeah, did you too. take sides? Did you choose sides? Like, where did you go after the split? How did you survive the split? Or, or like, did you have to hang with Dame? Could you go certain places because Jay Friends was there? Like, what was it like for you after the split with Ramsey's? Man. Like life at the end of Rockefeller to after, like what was it like? You know what I'm saying? Was it hostile? Was it pick a side? I mean, you know, when, at the end of the day, like I said, I got love for everybody, man. So when Rock went down, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> My boy, young guru, shout out to him, you know, because um, Jay went to become <clears throat> Jay went and, and became um, president of Def Jam. President of Def Jam. So. Being like he became president of Dev Jam, you know what I mean? He snatched a couple of people from Rockefeller to become, and you know, it's at Dev Jam too. And Young Guru was one of those dudes too, as well. And you know, shout out to Young Guru, you know what I mean? I started doing work. I still did work for Hope and everything, you know what I'm saying? And whether it was personal, whether it was business, you know what I mean? Because <clears throat> that's what I was doing, you know what I'm saying? Those, those, are, those are my boys. I'm going, I'm going. You know what I mean? So this, this, this is my boys, you know what I mean? Like, at the end of the day, it's like, yeah, like I said, I was, I was doing stuff for Hulk been there, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, with Guru, Young Guru, you know what I mean? I was still, you know, doing what's a little work at, at Def Jam. What's your relationship with Jay-Z to date? Like, what's your relationship with Jay-Z to date? We would see Jay-Z now, how would it be? Still the bro, man. That's Hope, still the bro, you know what I mean? Like, that's my bro, you know what I mean? Like, he'll see me be, before I even see him, and he'll be like, yo, like, before I see, you know what I'm saying? And I'm like, I, it still bugs me out to this day. I'll be like, yo, yo, oh, I should be saying yo. Uh, yo, you know I know Jay-Z. Yeah. Like, yo, know what I'm you know saying? Like, Jay-Z, my guy. But, you know, yeah, he shows so much love that he makes me feel like I'm Jay-Z. You know what I'm saying? Another like, question, bro. right?